हेलो फ्रेंड्स सो लेट मी डिस्कस टुडे वेरी इम्पोर्टंट टॉपिक शुड यू डे टू आउटसोर्स सेक्स आई नो दिस इज अ टॉपिक विच इज गोइंग टू एनोय सम ऑफ यू बट इट इज वेरी इम्पोर्टेंट टू अंडरस्टैंड दिस दिस इज माय थर्ड लेसन वीडियो एंड फोर्थ वीडियो इन दिस सीरीज ब्रेक थ्रू बिजनेस ब्लू प्रिंट्स विथ एन एल पी सो फ्रेंड्स एक्चुअली आई एम टॉपिंग टॉकिंग अबाउट मार्केटिंग एंड इन मेरेज लाइफ वट इज सेक्स इन बिजनेस इट इज मार्केटिंग मार्केटिंग इज फन मार्केटिंग इज प्लेजर एंड मार्केटिंग इज जॉय ऑफ बिजनेस See in business, what happens? People purchase your product, and in life, in married life, there are byproducts, babies. And in business, the byproducts are customers, clients. So basically, what happens? You know, it is not easy to produce babies. I still remember one of my friend used to avoid uh, babies because. he was thinking that oh my god if there is baby then i cannot do uh, you know i cannot progress in my career and i cannot do whatever i wanted to do in my life for example uh, if there are babies we have to feed them and uh, if they do something we need to change the diapers also they are crying and they are throwing tantrums and uh, you know Uh, like uh, we need to help them with their homework and uh, prepare food for them you know so many things but because of that you don't stop loving your babies because you love your babies and because of that what will happen you will still have sex with your life partner same way in business when you will sell products people will ask for discounts people will ask to give you a refund and for such people you have to do marketing you need to do lead generation you need to work on marketing spend money buy some marketing softwares manage some you know communications and there are lots of stuff you have you have to do and i know that there is no other option and for that some people think that i will outsource my marketing and i am not going to do the marketing i will ask somebody else who will manage my marketing but you should not do this why let me tell you one thing friends i am a nlp trainer nlp stands for neuro linguistic programming and this is one of the best tool of mind power very advanced mind power by using this tool you can have get, you can have amazing results right and if you want to see you can go to www.hitesparmar.guru and you will find so many testimonials the miracles i produced with nlp but what happens in nlp there is a technique it is not actually technique but it is reality of our life but let's say a technique called anchoring now what is this anchoring anchoring is something a trigger right so whenever an event occurs in the environment which will trigger a response from you you will behave in a particular manner so uh, let me do one thing i will explain you with some gestures because right now this video is being seen in india pakistan usa uk sri lanka australia yes 
so what happens everybody has different uh, language culture understanding style of working but let me show you something look at my hand gestures and uh, just check uh, what is your first uh, reaction or what is your first feeling uh, this is my first gesture right what do you understand by this write down in the comment okay now i will do second gesture mm. what do you think or what is your emotion about this gesture okay now i will do next gesture you can write down into the comment box mm. what do you think about this gesture okay you can write down into the comment box okay next gesture what do you think about this gesture and this so everybody has different meaning but in a particular country or a particular culture the meaning is same and you can ask anyone around you they will come up with same meaning even though i said nothing i just uh, did some gestures and with that visual image of my doing that gesture you got something i communicated something and you understood something because these gestures are anchors these are visual anchors and these anchors are so nicely weaved into our nature and our understanding structure our background programming of our mind that you don't need any pro extra processing time and you understand it so now what will happen i remember a story of sunday uncle over here what happened that a person was very busy after his marriage because expenses were going up so what he did was he just accepted part time job to you know meet the ends so what happens that now uh, monday to saturday he was busy in doing two jobs a day traveling from home to office office to office office to home so whenever he arrives home what happens uh, that uh, his kids are sleeping his wife gave him some food to you know for nurturing and uh, every day just uh, this was the routine but what happens so whenever he came uh, at sun uh, sunday he is with his kids so what happened one day he had a officially holiday in his office both offices and he came back at home and his both kids shouting wow sunday uncle sunday uncle sunday uncle <laughs> so basically he was anchored into mind of his kids as sunday uncle so uh, this is actually the fun part of it but uh, do remember because what i want to explain to you is you are the face in your business you might be thinking that people are buying your products people are buying your services or people are buying any of your stuff they are buying your book or they are just you know uh, talk to you but they are actually not buying anything they are buying your face because you are the face in your business and see basically what happens a maid can manage a kid but only mother who can nurture the kid so if you outsource your marketing department because of the problems you are facing like buying some uh, spending some money buying leads talking to them and nurturing them mailing them whatsapp them lot it seems like lots of stuff and still people are you know 
they are throwing tantrums, they are asking for discounts, they are giving the refunds, and they are asking for, you know, more. Everything is there, I know. But your clients are your wealth. And you cannot outsource wealth generation to anybody else. Otherwise, remember the story of Sunday Uncle. So what I was explaining over here is NLP anchoring gave us lots of insight and this anchoring working really very well in our life. And when we are the face of our business, the way we dress, the way we talk, the way we discuss, the way we communicate, the way we nurture people, the way we discuss with them, the way we respond, the way we smile at them. Everything is going to create a value into the mind of your customer and from that point, the customer will become a client. And you cannot outsource this particular, this marketing because the marketing is the fun and joy of your business and marketing is wealth of your business. So I hope that you liked this episode and be in touch with me and bye for now. See you soon into the next episode.